if running a cheetah breeding project was only playing with cubs and African cats all day. That would be the life. But that isn't the case. It takes a lot of hard work, people, and dedication. As well as resources, time, money, and a whole lot more. Many times, a project is just finding solutions to a problem. This is Ivory, who likes to climb on top of his 10-foot shade platform. Cheetahs aren't known for climbing. How'd he get up there? The concern is when he climbs down, the tension on his muscles, ligaments, joints, and bones. Ivory has since been released into a protected wild, so his problem no longer exists. But I had a similar concern with Gabriel's platform. It was too high. Cheetahs like the high ground, so they can watch out for predators and prey. My concern was for his joints over time. That's a long way down for Gabriel to jump, so... The idea is I'm going to be creating a stair step. And I'm going to basically one here and then one here. So he can step down, step down, and done. Otherwise, he's putting a lot of pressure on his joints. I mean, he's, getting, he's five years old, but I don't, you know, problems develop early. And then they kind of compound later in life, so... Looking to turn this into this. The materials for this project were all found in a recyclable scrapyard. It's a lot of work, but the reward is peace of mind, a job well done, and a gratifying thank you from the customer. You'll see. But all work and no play is boring for both Gabriel and I. I always tease it's pleasure before business with Gabriel. Whenever I work inside the camps, I always visit the animals first. <sighs> okay, back to work. It's time to play with the cheetahs again. Good morning, good morning. Maybe this is why it took me over a week to finish this project. Report your fur, buddy. So basically I have to close this gate here for Gabriel, keep him in, lock him in here while the workmen work on my or on his stair step. Good boy, good boy, good boy. With Gabriel secure in his feeding camp, good. the local staff can help me piece together his stair step. That's all buddy. Good boy. You gotta stay Gabriel. Pause. Look who's watching. This is Papis and Steven from Cheetah Experience. Remember I told you a project is people? I really needed their help to finish this. So, let us fast forward. Steven and Papis showed me how to dig and secure a post hole with nothing more than a metal rod, a shovel, and some rocks. Then, they helped me secure the platforms to the posts. Gabriel's first tier step table. Stairs, so that is sturdy. That lasts a long time, it's good. Just a wee bit more. You know, there's, there's habitat for humanity, and this is habitat for Cheetah I don't know what you call it. It's time to play with the cheetahs again. Hey, why he's so excited? Now we got a bowl for Gable here, see if he likes it. Get it, Gabe. Thing. Gabe, look. Gabe. Not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> That's hard to impress a cheetah, you know. Now you'll play with me. <laughs> Good boy, good boy. Good 
boy. All play and no work makes Gabriel a happy cheetah. All right, this is the uh, habitat for cheetery, I'm calling it. Uh, this is a uh, stair set for Gabriel to help his joints and his back to protect him in his older age. I got the help from a uh, fantastic staff here at Cheat Experience, um, Bap uh, Bapis and Stephen. And I really thank you guys for helping me build this. I could not do it without you. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. We're always friends now. <laughs> thank you. Thank Appreciate you. it. I still had some work to do on it. Board up the front and sides and weatherproof it. With Papis and Steven gone, I had to resort to Gabriel's help to finish the project. I needed Gabriel to pre-drill the holes for the screws. Here are the dent holes. That's a powerful light, man. <laughs> Gabriel wanted to help me with the weatherproofing, but I told him thanks, but not this time. Hey, boy, it's just pink, buddy. Yeah, it's just pink. It was done. Gabriel's two tiered stair steps was finished. All that was left was Gabriel's seal of approval. That's yours, buddy. That is your stair step. What do you think, Gabriel? Good boy. What do you think, buddy? Hello. What do you think about your new stair steps, huh, buddy? Hello. Jump. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Ah! Good boy. You want to sit there with me? <laughs> not very comfortable, huh? And then, not so surprising it's in Gabriel's you, sake, a slobbery, it's grooming, okay. purring you so thank welcome. you. You are so welcome for that platform. It's just a pleasure, pleasure building this stair step for you, buddy. Yeah, it's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. Make sure my buddy's joints are safe, huh? For that long journey of life. Yeah, buddy. you're welcome. Yeah. You are most welcome. And a little thank you for his stair steps in that suite. So, how many times have you thanked your construction worker for a job well done? You're welcome, buddy. That's a proper use of a stair step. <laughs> Nice. There you go, buddy. Good boy. With a little encouragement, I showed him how to get down. Hey, buddy. Good boy. Good boy. That's, that's just a little fear there. Thank you, bud. Oh, good boy. Good boy. This truly was a pleasure to build for Gabriel. I like to kid and joke, but when you're doing something for someone you love, it doesn't feel like work. If you like this video, please share it and give it a thumbs up. And consider joining my channel. Join my coalition and subscribe.